hey guys welcome back so after a bit of misstep of development microsoft was finally able to get windows 10 mobile build 10.5.6.63 out to users in the fast info insider program today in the morning the os update is considered cumulative and therefore does not add new features but interested focus on fixes and improvements right microsoft's gabriel in fact noted that these updates are very targeted changes to fix specific issues that were noted from the previous builds and mostly upgrade fixes and other corner cases things are per device model right so looking for even more detail a microsoft employee has posted a small change log she posted the following information about today's update and over other than the general stability battery and performance improvement that come with each of these version uh, there are also a few things that you have reached out to me and that should be improved and these are uh, typing on polish keyboard in outlook mail turn by turn direction over bluetooth in car battery usage with iris recognition reliability of quick action setting page microsoft band used with cortana these are the kind of other changes you can see these are not major but these are in terms of fixtures you can say and uh, there are a few important points uh, that you should note before downloading this update and i want to share my experience with this current build and if you are from previous updates or coming to the new update like if you are from build 36 to an ranked update to dot 63 so make sure you free at least 1.5 gb of free space on the device or phone memory the installation needs around 879.5 mb of space and the update file size is around 258.2 sorry 285.1 mb so make sure you have good wi-fi connection it's not going to work on mobile data and like last thanks to microsoft they didn't check their space before downloading and installing and even though the, if your phone has no space they start downloading and they install again and they will say there is no space better they can check it before and because i will say twice my mobile data from 285 mb twice so it comes to around 750 mb because i installed this asphalt 8 in the phone memory due to get some good performance on the 640 xl to make a demo guys for you and I just move to memory card and then I can try to install this and some space problems. So lots of rattling are there. So make sure you do these things. Make a pre of at least 1.5 to 2 gigs of storage in the internal memory or the phone memory. Coming to the build now. Since the build number has the usual same base numbering at 10.586, that means there is no new features addition. And just as I mentioned, the release notes is just uh, fixes. And we will just see. Uh, I played this uh, device the latest build for around you know uh, one hours and more. So. Uh, since I am using the device as a daily so I can notice these things and I will let me know guys uh, what the build is all about So let me quickly open few of the apps and first let me close before we move ahead uh, Let us check the bugs that I have filed for Windows and mobile OS. You've already seen my playlist videos Let us see whether those bugs are fixed or not. So the, uh, there is a very good bug uh, I will say color limitation of task manager apps. So we will see here So I've opened quite a lot app and it is still showing only four five six seven apps as of now so we'll close all of them and we'll see what are the other apps are in the progress in the open so you can see other apps are coming so lots of apps are still in the background so they hadn't fixed that so these are the reasons that cause sudden battery in for your windows 10 mobile so make sure you check your phone update in this way you are running apps you can see again seven apps are running the backgrounds it's not showing so that specs were not filled and i checked the store live tile issues Like when the, if you even turn off the tile and it's coming or not, we will see and show product on tiles is turned off and during the demo we will see, uh, it's not fixed, I saw it, the tiles were coming and uh, people live tiles so still not fucks, I have disabled my Twitter account here, it's still is showing my Twitter contacts here and so many things are there and you can notice the performance in between that, how the device is working, I will say, uh, there is a slight improvement even though this device is very good uh, you don't feel much difference here so day by day usage are there and uh, let me open few apps for you maybe you can notice let's open whatsapp as usual take some time in loading and let me open a big apps like word excel so things are loading very fast so seems day by day the build is getting stable as you can see there is a very less delay considering it has one gig seven snapdragon 400 processors only so i will say it's kind of improvement and instantly locks the phone also 
let me see one drive it's fine no problem and let me play the 4k video support i have already shown you the still the windows 10 mobile is not able to play 4k video you will see here uh, this is the 4k video let me rotation log so this thing was fixed as you can see see it's not fixed with xbox.com it's not fixed here so your windows 10 mobile will still not able to play 4k even though it will play full hd video i will show you again this is the full hd video 1920 by 1080 p resolution it's playing that one smoothly it's not a problem so if you are kind of a video movies watching lots of stuff in browsing so you get some problem here and uh, apart from that uh, things are fine let me quickly go to here each settings are loading very fast and let me see what's the camera is working now whether there any improvement in the terms of image capturing and taking i will take a picture in front of you so camera is taking very fast slight improvement i can say and, uh, Still no rich captures came to this 640XL. Flash on. Living images, sorry, rich capture is there. Living images still not came. I don't know. Lumia 830 has, which has same processor as 640XL, but still this phone doesn't have. And let me play a game for you. Let's see how this asphalt is working. I shown you previously, this is very working very smoothly, apart from some framing audio drops, uh, which are usual. And once I found only in last one week, I, I used to play daily so only once I found with it complete week there is one slight frame drop of I saw you the screen uh, turn a slightly blurred and some random colors are coming that's for moment only we'll just play quickly uh, asphalt 8 airborne it's one of the heaviest game I told you it's around 1.7 GB and it's a better uh, GPU and uh, CPU processor And there are other pictures like user has been able to confirm that the, the Microsoft band, especially the band one is working better with this update. And we have noted on Twitter that Windows Hello login action also appears to be quicker in addition to the noted improved battery usage. If you are running Windows 10 mobile on the Lumia 950 XL and 950, so Windows Hello is working very fast now. So these are the improvement for I think the major devices, for small devices just the battery in. I will check the other battery stuffs, uh, wait for the detailed video, it's just a quick video I want to show you guys what are the changes and all in front of you because uh, if, if you use the device regularly and you are again going to use a new build, you will notice immediately. So I notice uh, quite improvement. I have other phones like uh, low-end phones, Lumia 520 and 630, I am updating them. So stay tuned, I will show you guys in the coming days, maybe by today and tomorrow I will upload the new video, I will first check them out detailedly. So the game is loading very fine, I don't see any frame drop, you, maybe you also see there is no drop and all either. So there is no problem at all in gaming you can see, I am playing very roughly, so nothing, no drops at all, fine. You can see so gaming is working very good i will just pause it here and see other things here so anything left let's open microsoft edge and see how it works so this is also loading very good tabs are coming very fine so overall build is getting smoother day by day so if you are planning to stall from windows phone 8.1 definitely you can go ahead check out my other videos i have already posted a detailed step by step how to upgrade to windows 10 mobile from running windows phone 8.1 or windows 8 settings so let me show you build number first in case you are wondering so you can see it's uh, build uh, 10586.63 
so that's all guys it's a quick review and uh, let me know in the comments if you face any problem and if, did you notice anything and i will also make i said i will lumia 520 other low-end phones i will update soon give me time i first i will test it before showing in front of you so stay tuned and uh, don't forget to watch the upcoming videos and if you think uh, i like your video you give me thumbs up and share the, my videos and subscribe me to watch more thanks for watching i'll talk in my next video